Hey everyone, it's Meatballs with Veteran Craft. I just wanted to make a video kind of going over the features of the dynamic map, which if you're not using, you're missing out. Um, it's a plugin that we use on our server. Basically, it allows you to view the map, a map of the world um, from the browser, not from in-game. Uh, and there's a lot of features that it's very useful for players. What you're first going to do is you're going to go to our homepage, veterancraft.net. Up here on the top right, this link will always be here. Live map. Click that. You'll see a Google Earth type image of the world here. And in a second, all the players that are online will render up. And um, you can see our vast ocean. And this little place marker in the middle, that's spawn. Um, so a couple of things. Um, you can zoom in, zoom out, just like Google Earth so you can use the scroller on your uh, mouse or you can use these buttons here so I'm going to just zoom in to spawn Vitropolis show you a couple of features as you can see um, you can zoom in pretty far and get a kind of a view of where you are this is the plaza and um, this is the PvP arena these are the shops so actually what we're going to do is show you um, the 3D version. So you click this block up here and you can kind of see more of, a, of how everything is built up. Uh, you can click here and it'll go back flat. And right here on the right you have the worlds. So we have Vitronia, our main world. We have both flat and 3D views. We have the nether, which if you click here, this is the nether view. Uh, you can zoom way out and you can see all that has been explored in the nether and then the outer reaches currently this is our kind of resources map you can see um, that it's only rendered where people have explored and it has the same two 3d and flat layers um, on the right here you can see all the players that are online and if you want to see someone or zoom into where they are you click them and it'll center the map on them and you just zoom in and you can see where they're walking around so if you're looking for a buddy, you want to locate him, just click him on the Dynamap. Up here in the middle, you'll have the time of day in, the, in that world, um, so you can see if it's day or night. A couple of things that you might want to know is, one, we don't allow web, web chat in, in our dynamic map like a lot of other servers. Uh, we, used to, we used to have that and, and came up with an issue of people who were banned who would come and spam the chat with from the browser. So it was kind of useless to have them. We also disabled the speech bubbles because of the uh, trolls that were uh, going around causing trouble. So we just disabled that. Another thing you should be aware of is that staff can be invisible on dynamic map. So don't think that they're not watching you if you're, you know, up to no good. And another uh, feature I wanted to show you, say you wanted to get, you wanted to share a location with someone in the forums. Okay, so you get close to your view. Say I want to show the Baywalk football stadium. I zoom in to 3D view and right down here on the bottom left there's this little link button. Click that. That'll screen capture this and then that will put the URL right here in your in your bar. You can copy and paste that. So that's how to find that's how you link to a specific view. Another feature unique to Veteran Craft um, well, other servers who use residents have it too, um, is a view of residences. So, say I zoom out of the world here, zoom out, and on the left here, you got the layers. Right now, we only have these three layers. We're going to be adding another couple layers, uh, landmarks and cities and stuff like that. But for now, on the residence layer, you can enable that layer, and you'll see all the residences. These are cuboids that have been purchased or claimed by the other players. Um, but anyway, you can see the, all the residences. And you can zoom in. You know, you can get a, a sense of where you might want to settle if you want to stay away from people. Um, a sense of where the bigger residences, which are typically cities, are. Uh, you can see the railways that are residenced. Um, but so if you want to find out who owns that residence, you just go to it and click on it, and it'll show you the name of the residence and the owner. And so you can actually, if you have, if you're a knight or above, you can res TP to that location. 
So if you just want to explore, that's a great way to kind of get around the map. For those of you coming in from YouTube uh, looking for um, a tutorial on how to install Dynamap and stuff like that, I'm sorry, this was just kind of a, an overview of how to use it for our users on our server. I hope it was helpful to see some of the features that you could have with this plugin. Um, it's one of our favorite plugins, uh, and I recommend it. And also, if, if you're looking for a server to check out that has Dynamic Map, come check out Veteran Craft. We've been around for over a year, and we're not going anywhere. We're run by adults. All the staff are required to be 18 or older. We're also 100% legit, so all these builds in our server are built from actually mined materials. Um, so there's no spawned items, there's no creative privileges for staff and whatnot. So come check us out.